This neighborhood eatery with the trendy decor is not exactly a mom and pop place. We are business partners here and mom also. <laughs> I can't both. forget she's my daughter. In, in Egypt, we traditionally do a tahini sauce. In November 2021, Dina Fahim and Sahar Ahmed opened Koshri Mama in Somerville. I'm vegan, Dina's vegetarian. We said, well, wouldn't it be nice to kind of highlight street food of Egypt and what isn't vegan, we're gonna make it vegan. Everyone eats street food in Egypt, says Fahim, who studied culinary arts at Boston University. It's like a connector for people. It's where poor people will eat, average class will eat. It, honestly, sometimes you see people with plenty of money and wealthy people just eating around a street food cart. Ahmed and Fahim first launched Koshiri Mama in farmer's markets and as a pop-up before they opened the restaurant. Their cuisine is inspired by Ahmed's mom. When she and my dad immigrated here from Egypt, she missed food from Egypt so much. So one of the things that she made was koshiri, which is a very typical street food in Egypt. Koshiri is Egypt's national dish made with rice, macaroni, chickpeas, lentils, fried onions, and sauces. The first trace of koshiri was in the 14th century, and it was brought by a Moroccan traveler. And he talked about an Indian dish called kichiri, and it was, over the years, transformed. Koshri Mama's street food relies on beans, chickpeas, and lentils for protein. Dips and sauces are used abundantly. Shawarma, usually made with meat, is a medley of grilled mushrooms, onions, and sweet red peppers. Falafel is made with fava beans. Our actual dough for the falafel is a green dough. It has a lot of greens in it. So and it's fava beans. Yes, it's made with fava beans, and yes. some people will mix it with chickpeas as well. And it's usually put in a beautiful bread, baladi bread, which we make here, actually. That's Fahim's aunt making the bread. So you're saying falafel, and I've always said falafel. So it's falafel. Falafel. Correct. That's the correct way, falafel. Yep a minute and a half to mm -hmm. two minutes it'll plop up and it'll be ready it'll be like a golden brownish color this is home cooking made from scratch and as authentic as you can get says ahmed i thought it would be so nice to share that feeling food also is memories of people and family and good times and kind of ties you into where you're from go right in you dip it in that sauce in egypt we say belhana with shifa so it's with like happiness and good health. All right. To happiness and good health. <laughs> I could get into street food. <laughs> <laughs> and our friends at Kashari Mama say that Typically, Egyptian street food is made from leftovers that had a lot of protein. It would help people then get through the day. That's right. And Sahar and Dina actually now offer w brunch every Sunday, and the menu changes weekly. This summer, they're hoping to bring in entertainment, and they recently got their liquor license, so they are really off to a good start. You seem to enjoy it. I did. So good. <laughs> Coming up, street food by the truckload.